everyone welcome back to another video of salesforce bytes my name is Zimanshu, and in this video we'll talk about search layouts now what are search layouts these search layouts are nothing but these are object based configurations wherein whenever you search a record on the global search and you get a list of fields that come up with it right for example if i go to the global search here and i try to find test contact right what happens when you see this record when you hover over it you see this is the information that you see so this is your search layout right what all things you see here will will, will are is defined via search layouts right is the same for all objects let me try to figure out let me see the a user record so when i hover over a user record what comes up this this information comes up which is different again right so you can have per object basis search layouts configured right and this is based on the user relevance and can be unique for every profile so you can configure search layouts and you can also have it different for different profile how, how cool is that right every object has a default layout and up to 10 fields can be added so you can have a maximum of 10 fields when you want to see a record the maximum fields that you can get here is 10 not more than that all right and buttons don't appear on the lightning experience search layouts if name field is a text it is a mandatory field if it is an auto number it is not mandatory so if it is a text field your uh, name field that's the prime that's your primary key or you know the uh, main audit field that you have for every object if that's of the type text then you have to have it on the search layout if it is an auto number you don't have to uh, keep it on the search layout it will become non-mandatory all right search layouts are not available that means object is not searchable which means you have not allowed search for that particular object or that object is not searchable by salesforce if this layout is not available and search layouts respect the field level security which means if you have visibility to four fields out of five only four will be visible not five even though you have configured it all right let's take a look at how do we set this up so let's go to setup and let's go to an object let's go to let's say leads and let's what's wrong let's get rid okay it's lead it's not leads so let's go to lead and let's say if i want to create click on a lead record already what happens if i try to find betty bear if i want to hover over here i see this information right starting from the title followed by the uh, till the owner alias right you cannot have buttons here right those are global actions so those are available there but these buttons the buttons cannot be available on this particular layout all right let's go to lead and we should see search layouts here yeah this is again an object level configuration uh, very recently we have talked about compact layouts we have talked about field sets and now we are talking about search layouts right let's take a look at this so if you notice see there are a lot of search layouts and there's a default layout configured for every profile see there's a default layout and what's the default layout the default layout considers con contains the name title company till the owner alias which is exactly what we are seeing here right starting from the name title company till the owner alias all right what i can do is let's say if i want to modify the default layout can i do that yes i can do that so i can get rid of some fields i'll say remove mobile remove phone remove i just want these four five fields and i can just say override the search result column customization for all users if i do this this will immediately reflect for everyone who is using this particular search layout all right and if i want to add a custom button i can do that here so this is something that can be done but there are no customizable standard buttons for this view i'll click on save for now and my default search layout has modified and every user is currently assigned the default layout which means my view will change for betty bear now let's try to see so i still see this because i have not refreshed it let me try to refresh and let's try to find betty bear now so if i try to hover over it so you see the fields have been limited and i only see four or five fields now not all of them right that's one thing what is the other thing the other thing is you can go to search layouts and you can try to modify it for every user instead of doing it for the default layout here directly you can just go ahead and click on the edit button for the layout and you can modify it and once you do that this will modify the search results for this particular profile that's mentioned here all right and another important thing to notice is you might get all the fields available here that is from the object but whichever fields are not searchable will not be searchable which means you have to take a look at what fields and what objects are searchable in your lightning experience and you can take that as a help document and accordingly configure it but more or less what happens with projects is you know you might want to have four or five unique identifiers for every profile so you go ahead and uh, configure the default layout and you edit it for everyone and if there's a specific scenario for a use case let's say one profile needs to see one extra field you go to that profile and you modify it that's all all right so this is how you see your search layouts all right cool that's all i had for the search layouts video i'll see you in the next one bye